What is going on guys, Nathan here. Welcome back to another Borderlands 2 video. Today what I got for you guys is a few tips and tricks on farming savagely and also a few things that you guys might not have known because I didn't find it anywhere else on YouTube. So the first thing is the quickest way to farm savagely in the known location which is like uh, right before you find uh, Corporal Reese I think. So uh, this was actually shown to me by one of my Steam friends and I will uh, put his link, or not his link, his Steam name somewhere on screen right now. But basically what you guys are going to want to do is follow my path that I'm showing you guys right now. Um, when you guys spawn into Three Horns Divide, I think it is, uh, get into your vehicle and then go uh, towards the direction that I'm going. And then be sure that if Bully Mongs do get um, aggroed, um, they won't probably stay aggroed for long as long as they're not showing up on your map anymore once you get to that certain horn looking thing. But basically, um, go over there, and then once you guys um, go past that, um, you guys will hear some battle music start to play, and then you guys know that you guys are in the correct area. Um, if you guys do this correctly, no bully mongs will spawn. So basically, um, you can actually farm Savage Lee while he's charging at you. So just get on top of the thing that you guys see me doing um, in the gameplay, and then basically wait for him to come towards you. And then just take him out because if you actually wait for him to get past the shadow because if he actually uh, is still in the lighted area bully monks can spawn so basically wait for him to get past the shadow and then take him out now you can run this as many times as you guys really want to but the thing is here's another thing people have a few people have made a video about maybe uh, farming savagely twice in one run but honestly, I think I found a method to farm him three times if you're really lucky in one run. So uh, what you guys are going to want to do is, well, this is how I found it out. Basically, I farmed savagely in this method. Then I actually uh, walked back to the spawn location. Um, and then I was like trying to figure out a location to spawn to. And then I hear someone screaming, boom, baby. And then I'm like, wait, is that savagely? And I see some enemies aggroed in the location that I'm going to be showing you guys right now. Uh, so uh, basically in this location, if you're lucky, sometimes you'll spawn or sometimes you'll go there and you guys are going to be seeing uh, bully monks aggroed. So if you guys see uh, bully monks aggroed as, like right off the bat from spawn or when you guys actually go to that location, you guys know that Savage Leaf spawned in a different location. So you can actually spawn to um, the left of spawn or right of spawn. So honestly, if you guys get lucky, you could once again farm them three times, but it honestly just depends. As you you guys can see right now the second location the one that I talked about to your right um, I actually got lucky once and um, I got some footage for you guys of him spawning right when I actually spawned in to my right and as you guys can see right there it's pretty legit so yeah once again you know you can do this as many times as you guys want and if you guys are lucky hey maybe like if you're like super lucky like one out of a million chances you might even get three unkempt heralds in one run who even knows guys but anyways use these three combination of locations to farm you guys up some heralds but anyways hope you guys enjoyed this if you guys did please leave a like down below and if you guys want to share this with other people that play Borderlands 2 then please do it really does get on people's nerves when people are you know complaining all the time about uh, savagely being hard to farm and kind of stuff but anyways once again thank you guys so much for watching and I'll catch you guys in my next video peace yeah. Yeah.